Howdy doody everybody, my name is Kev Gooey and welcome back to Princess Evangel W Happiness. Have? Thank you. I was happy I had done well too. Even if I comprehended the striking and countering procedure in my head, I couldn't quite get my body to move in kind. I was reasonably clumsy at first, but I was able to pull it off decently this time around. Yeah, yeah. Uh-oh. I focused hard on practicing the strike counter technique in preparation for tomorrow, right up until our practice time came to an end. Just as I was about to go home at the usual time, a voice called out to me from the entryway. Konomi-chan! More or less, it is hot. Hmm? What kind of favor? No? Oh yeah, of course I don't. Wow, that really makes me happy. Oh no, I didn't mean it like that. I just never thought you'd do something like that just for me, Konomi-chan. Oh, heat stroke. Ha ah, ha ha, yeah, I know. Yeah. We had no idea if I could stay at the lodge or not yet, as Ritsuko chan was asking for the favor right then. So, is the headmistress at school today? Speaking of Ritsuko chan, she had planned on visiting home for the entire summer vacation, but cut it short and came back early. She explained that she was just. she was just to act as sister's chaperone. Maybe it will. Yeah. One more week until the tournament, huh? Your opponent was you guys, son, right? Is she really strong? Konomi chan nodded with a grave expression. You've been practicing the Nagunata since you were little too, Konomi-chan. That's right. Honobi-chan enrolled as an intermediary core student, hadn't she? In order to be recognized as a genuine filet fil de la vansin, you had to be enrolled since primary course. It wasn't genuine in that sense, but so it really was a big deal that she happened to have two titles. Something told me using Naginata as a modern warfare would end badly. But, I get it now. I wonder if it's because you trained so hard under your grandmother. You've never made any attempt to spar with the other club members. I was just wondering why that might be. When they said that, she looked upset. Yes, 
Oh. Minomi Chan was a swords swordswoman capable of making it to the national finals, after all. She could find plenty of sparring partners if she had gone to a specialized school, but that wasn't the case here at Vonson. And on top of that, her advisor doesn't actually participate in club activities. But all of that, she had made it to the Nationals two years in a row. To me, the petite underclassman walking alongside me looked absolutely radiant. I couldn't help but find Konomi-chan to be dazzling ever since I joined the club. Listen, I think you're really amazing, Konomi-chan. We don't get to hear this title very much in Final Course. But I've come to realize that Lame San's Mercy really does suit you best. Although, I definitely don't think that Darling Doll fits you poorly either. Ah, I just noticed the, uh, the little box became uh, sharp as spikes. After seeing her face and ears flush a, a bright shade of red, I thought that she really was the Mignon Poupe. Surprise, what happened? I don't think I've ever seen you wear that. Have I? That was the very first thing Ritsuka chan said after opening her mouth. About what? Ah. Well, I would be bored if that was the case. Yeah, it was more like I was the one who pushed for it, in fact. Well, it just kind of seemed to work out that way. Huh? I stood there astounded when she refuted me all of a sudden. What? Her enthralled reply was so dangerous it left me even more astounded than before. Hey, come on. Oh, really? But I'm not a swordsman. Oh, that's no good. The girls can't touch me then. What is, what is this supposed to be a compliment? Gotcha. I agreed as well. Both of them return after about 10 minutes. What? Oh, really? I was honestly surprised. I never expected the headmistress to agree. Ritsugo chan said before directing a warm gaze her way. Wait, mom? Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, yeah. I see. Thank you, Konomi chan. Aww, she's so happy. 
これでマサヤ様は正式な合宿の参加者となりました明日からはさらに厳しくしごきますよ Why didn't we instruct her one? Oh no, oh. Don't go too hard on me. Oh boy. Ooh, we got permission to stay at the lodge. Oh, we did. Uh, oh. All right. Well, seems like we're not staying at the lodge, but tomorrow. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of how the events are going. Apparently, we、uh, are sharp as. I don't know what, a guillotine? But yeah, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you guys did, then please slime that like button and subscribe down below for more awesome videos. Thank you everybody for watching this episode, and you will hear me in the next one. Goodbye!